Hi, if you like the video, please remember to subscribe. Hi everybody, one of the questions that we have to ask ourselves when we look at action cams is whether they do really, really do what they say on the box. So with the SJ Cam M20, can it really do 1080p 60 frames a second? Because that is a pretty good feature to be able to do. Can it really do 720p 120 frames a second? And the answer to those both of those questions, I'm happy to say, is yes. And I'm going to show you here. I'm going to I'm going to prove it as well. Because at 1080p 60 frames a second, video looks crisper and more lifelike than it does at 30 frames a second. Not saying that 30 frames a second is nice, but it's nice to do 60 frames a second. It also means that you can slow things down. And especially at 720p 120 frames a second, you get very smooth video indeed for your slow motion so anyway let's have a look at it now what you're seeing here is this is premiere pro and premiere pro is set up to when you're previewing your video and you're editing to basically show it at 30 frames a second now this might be a little bit difficult to see but we're at uh we're at um, second 22 in this little video clip and it's shot at 1080p and I've zoomed in so you can see the movement on the flag that's on this pier. And so if it was 30 frames a second, you'd expect as I were to click through it for every time uh, it to go to like one and then two and then three for the uh, for the frames to, to change on the one, the two and three. But as we can see, it's changing twice for every notch that it goes up and that shows you that this is definitely true 60 frames a second 1080p and it's not doubled either because there is clear movement on each frame so that shows you and that proves that the SJCam M20 shoot 1080p 60 frames a second which is fantastic now if we look at this little uh, video I've done here this is shot at 720p 120 frames a second so if we go to tenth of a second so what we should we should be seeing here is we should be seeing four frames for every time it clicks up so let's just see so we got one two three and it clicks up four and if we go back into ten one two three four and then it clicks down again so again there is movement on each of the frame frames again it might be for you to see it but i can see it on my screen as i click up one two three four that little boat is definitely moving so we've got true 720p 120 frames a second video at the sj cam m20 which is amazing it doesn't end there though this is 480p 640 by 480 you know the standard video we had up until a few years ago this is shot on the m20 this is 640 by 480 two hundred and forty frames a second that's amazing 240 frames a second so what we should see here is that as i'm clicking backwards and forwards on this video of the shuttlecock because i had to have something that would move fast what we should be seeing is eight um uh, steps if you like for each one that's on the um on the counter on premiere pro and let's just get somewhere where you can actually see the shuttlecock moving and it, it makes beautiful slow motion. Okay, the frame is a little bit off. You'd have to crop it if you wanted to do widescreen. But the slow motion you can do at 240 frames a second is really serious and very, very good indeed. Right, so the shuttlecock's moving, so let's get it to a whole... Let me get it to a whole second. There we go, so one, two, three... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then it changes. Let's go back in. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then it changes. True 240 frames a second video. You, I mean, look, look, look how smooth that is. It's amazing. And again, to get um, smooth slow motion, what you do is you shoot at a very high frame rate, say 240 frames a second, but then you change it in post-processing to 30 frames a second, and that gives you smoothness. So what we've got here with the M20 is a little camera that can not only shoot beautiful 1080p, 60 frames a second, we can even go a bit crazy, go up to 720, well, not the resolution down to 720, we go up to 120 frames a second, which is great, 
But if you want to do some almost specialist slow motion photography, say you wanted to look at your golf swing or all sorts of different things, you can do 640 by 480, which still looks okay at 240 frames a second. Absolutely amazing. Well done, SJ Cam. I can't wait to play with this camera a little bit more. My name's Rob from robnoffer.com. If you've enjoyed the video, hit like. If you want to see more of the same, press subscribe. Put your questions and comments down below, and I'll see you again soon.